Hello everyone, it is Lisa from Lisa Grateful Me. Welcome to my channel. I'm excited for a couple of reasons. First of all, there are more March Madness mini savings challenges that are rolling in. Um, are you wondering what I'm talking about? If you are, each year in the month of March, I work on mini savings challenges the entire year. And I consider it March Madness. And I threw it out there for all of my subscribers and all of um, different budgeting YouTubers that if they'd like to join me during March Madness, they can. Now, I do it every single day in the month of March. For other YouTubers, they might just do it once a week or maybe twice a week. It's up to them and how it fits into their budget. After I save money with mini savings challenges at the end of March, I gather all the money I saved and then I reallocate it to sinking funds and just different areas where I need to put the money. So if you want to join and you want to create some savings challenges and have a shout out on my channel, go ahead and email them to lisagratefulme at gmail.com and go ahead and submit them. Now, if you are a YouTube channel and you want to join, I will go ahead and print off the challenges that you gave me. For example, these are challenges from the Crafty Saver. She decided to do spring theme, and of course, she's got a little basketball challenge in there. Each of these icons can be worth whatever dollar amount you want. I'm hoping that everyone keeps the challenges kind of low, amount so that we can show off everybody's work and go through everyone's challenges. So what you would do is you would um, email me your challenges. I will print them out, shout them out, and then I will let you know how you can get them in the description. Some of the different YouTube channels have Kofi shops. Some have a free Google Drive folder. And I will leave all that information for you. So you go to my description box of this video. You can see all the people that are participating up to this point, And you can go and get these freebies. So you'll be prepared in March. Then two weeks before uh, March Madness, I am going to go ahead. I will show you everybody's challenges that were submitted. And yeah, I think you're going to love it. So here's these from the Crafty Saver from Miss Janet. These are the ones that I created. You can find these in my Ko-Fi shop or Kofi shop. And each of my icons are worth a dollar. This is from these darling Highland cows. I bet you have no idea who they're from. Laugh, laugh, giggle, giggle. They're from Oma Crafts and Budgets. And they're, they are so darn cute. And then these are from... Liam's mom, 247. She has a Ko-Fi shop or Kofi shop. Her name's Joe and she's from South Africa. And then we have these from Beth over at Six Girl Budgets. So there's quite a few challenges available. Everyone go grab them. Okay, let's get into today's challenges. I am thrilled about us working on my roll and save binder. This is the binder that is divided up by seasons. So I have challenges for winter that I want to complete. Not all of them are winter challenges. They're just challenges that I want to complete in the winter. And then I have all these in winter. Oh my goodness. And then I have spring. I have summer. I have fall. There's just... There are so many. So this is my roll and save binder and I will be doing roll and saves each week during 2025. So let's get going and let's get rolling. Let's start off with the winter savings here. I have five, six, seven, eight, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. And I'm going to do $5 more to make 30. Okay, let's roll. Let's start off with this darling one. So I rolled a 5, which is fabulous. So we're going to put a 5 over here on the side. And I am going to write five in the spot. So that's how I'm going to use this particular challenge. And I think for today, 
I am just going to add it to the envelope. Oh my goodness, I made a list for me to glue down the sides of my envelopes, and I didn't. Okay, another note for myself. Now, this is from Mary's Little Hen House over at Mary Love Country Living, and she sent it to me, and I want to work on it. In this book, there's um, scratch and roll. So these will be the ones that I'm rolling. And then after I finish those, on the back side of them, they have little challenges. After that, I'm going to add these to my minis. But let's start off with our first little chicken scratch, and we roll a six. Last time I worked on Mary Love Country Living's um, challenges, I rolled a six every time but once. So that was like big bucks, and I loved it because it was saving lots of money. I'm going to use, oh, look, oh my, I have an envelope right here with $20 in it. <gasps> is that the funnest you find an old envelope with 20 bucks well we are going to add that to our play today oh my goodness you guys i need to check all my envelopes before i get rid of them i hopefully in life i haven't thrown away money okay so there's that one this is gonna go to mary's challenge <laughs> lucky day lucky day lucky day all right, here's the birthday challenges. And I have so many birthdays in the month of January that let's try to do as much as this 20 for that as we can. Okay, we have a four. Looks like fours are the lucky number. Let's see here. So we already have four in here. Let's one two, three, four. We'll just probably end up exchanging all of this for the 20. Okay. A five. Love it. One, two, three, four, five. Gosh, that is so fun that I found a $20 bill. Loving it. Okay, here we go. A six. So we're up to $15. We're doing good. Um, let's do six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Woohoo! And let's roll one more time. And a five. Look at that, you guys. It will be exactly 20. So hopefully there's 15 ones here. And then we'll just put this 20 in. That's the bomb. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15. Wait, how come I have more? 10 and 10 is 20 and then it should have four. Oh yeah, this is the four. Okay. Hello. Just making sure. So $24 in our cat birthday roll and save. Yay. 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 The first week of January, we have, I think four birthdays. So yeah. All right, here is my abundant roll and save. It is an additional emergency fund. I am doing a thousand dollar emergent sunflower emergency fund, and I'm going to add to this. I mean, the money from this to my emergency fund. Oh my gosh, I hope that made sense. Okay, two dollars here. Let's add two. Let's see what other challenges I've got behind here. Oh, we've got our rainbow and color and our large and in charge. All right, I think we're going to, so we have three more challenges in here. Okay, let's stop with this one. So now this challenge should have nine, it has five, six, seven, eight, nine. Lovely, lovely. How many people want to bet that next week when I go to do this, I will not have sealed my envelopes? <laughs> okay, rainbow. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. We're going to roll the dice, and this will tell us what color we're going to color in a puzzle piece. So number three. Number three is yellow. Okay, love it. Let's just start with this one right here and color in this puzzle piece yellow. I can't wait to see how bright and vibrant 
and how fun this will be when it's all completed. And you know what? I love rainbows. I've just, you know, in Hawaii, they have the most beautiful rainbows. And I don't know. I just love them. Okay, so let's do let's do three dollars one two three okay we're gonna come back to this one if I have more money let's keep going let's do our large and in charge so what you do is each row is a line of play so I just roll one die whatever one it is I color it in and then I add it to the envelope and where's my envelope it is the cutest envelope ever okay well five Woohoo! Big bucks. I love that. I think I want to do a colored pencil and I'm going to color this row in. And then when I get down to here, you guys, then I am done with the challenge. So let's add five. One, two, three, four, five. And I need to make a note to myself to get this envelope rolling. What in the world? You know what, actually, instead of just clipping that, I'm going to use this for now until I get that envelope. So this was a freebie, you guys, um, that I gave out if you made a purchase over at the Happy Mailbox Co. If you didn't get it and you wanna get it, you can request it as your freebie if you make a purchase. What you do is you make a purchase and then within 24 hours, I send you a digital download. Right now, it is a Roll and Save Christmas Kittens, and they are so stinking cute. Maybe, do I have, oh, I have my Christmas binder right here. I want to show you guys. Christmas Kitten. Here it is. So here's the same thing. You roll the dice and you color in the square, and then look at that. Darling! so fun so fun and like i said in every video lately i am not messing around with christmas i am going to do my best to have things saved way before all right here is a challenge all of these challenges so far have been mine except for the one from mary and this one is from Seashell Saves. This is a roll and save um, that has to do with the Princess Bride movie. And my husband loves the Princess Bride movie. So we're just going to do one roll. I think I have enough money for one roll. And we're going to add $2 right here. Come, my love, I'll tell you a tale of a boy and a girl and their love story and how he loved her oh so much and all the charms she did possess. Possess. Okay. Let's do that. There's two here. This is going to be super fun. Maybe because my husband loves this one so much, maybe this should be a challenge for he and I just to go out on a date or do something fun. My roll and save um, challenges are going to be kind of like my minis this year. Once they're completed, I'm going to feed them into other challenges that I need to, or I'm going to use them for spending. They are going to be like a catch 22 where I use them for all different things like this one for birthdays, this one maybe for a date, the abundance one for... Um, my emergency fund. Okay, I really want to get back to this cutie patootie. Do I have enough? One, two, three, four, five, six. I do. So let's roll, baby, roll. And she rolls a six. That is a purple. Let's see. Let's see. I want to probably use a purple colored pencil. I have 10,000. So let's see. How come I can't find one right off the top? You know what? We're going to use a marker. Okay. Number six is purple. So now we've rolled a six and a three. So $9 in here. Love it. Oh my gosh. Love it so much. I think my roll and save day is going to be one of my favorites. Um, you know, I don't know though, national parks and my state savings, 
I am so in love with those. So we'll see. Heck, they're all my favorites, right? Okay, this looks a little wonky. It looks like the markers needs to dry. Okay, let's put $6 in. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we have an extra dollar that we will just save for next time. So now this challenge has six, seven, eight, and nine. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I have a question on the seasons. Do you consider winter, how long does it last? Does it go from December, January, February, and then March, spring? That's kind of what I'm thinking for me. March here in Utah is the world is waking up and the flowers and everything are starting to come up out of the ground and I just love spring so awesome and also how about a guess in the comments how much money do you think this abundant savings is going to um, bring about there are a lot of circles here I'm really excited to see the and to you know just add this extra amount for my extra savings with the, my emergency fund. All right, everyone, have a fabulous day. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget to grab your March Madness challenges. Don't forget to grab your freebie this week from the Happy Mailbox Co. And I will catch you on the next video. Bye.